Um, so I think South's you know, completely you know, about 18 out of 20 or something like that in the first half. And, and we've made you know, five mistakes in the first 20 minutes. So, uh, yeah, like just, you're not going to win too many games in the NRL. That sort of start, but you're certainly not going to be caught with size like South Sydney. Yeah, well, going just time and do it. It's going to hurt you. It hurts the night. It hurts big time. I say I was real proud of the way we fought back. At the end of the day, uh, we did ourselves no chance with, with our start. Can they take some of the credit for those mistakes with the press left Oh, I think you probably could, yeah. But, um, yeah, I don't know if it was someone. But, uh, yeah, but a couple of them just for, for lost in the tackle. Yeah, probably a couple, a couple of passes were uh, probably get under pressure. So, uh, yeah, obviously, uh, this time here, you know, sides, you know, defend really well at the start of games. You know, quite well, often we did that, and they obviously did that as well. So, um, uh, yeah, you yeah, know, that could be, at the end of the day, you know, it's been a bit of an ongoing problem for us. Craig, you looked at the incident with Sissy, although obviously at the moment uh, defending players were allowed to chat all the tackle players in the air. Um, is that, when we see an incident like that, does it make you think that needs to be reviewed or Yeah, it's a pretty, pretty tough um, six one and a half thousand other, really. Like, Again, you just let him stand there and catch a ball over the line and you can't tackle him until his feet hit the ground. You know, well, that's probably going to be more kicks and there's going to be more tries from kicks. Um, you know, I, I think, you know, I don't certainly you know, make no ill health to, to assist of the night, you know, but he, he tackled him early before he had the ball. I well, think that was the thing that, that was probably where he assisted with his, or he was going up, so basically his balance, he knocked him off balance before he you know, had the ball, so that was the, the reason it ended up so open. Um, but as I said, you know, if you if you take that rule out where you know you've got their feet got on the ground before you can tackle them, you know, the, the attacking player, well, you're going to see a lot more kicking, a lot more tries. So, but like I say, that was it looked really ugly there tonight. I suppose that that's just a, you know an incident that's been really waiting to happen with that rule. But like I say, it's it's, it's a hard one. Uh, yeah, if you go the other way. Cameron, you've spoken all about sort of your discipline of the over the last month. Is what is handling errors in the first three minutes? Is that part of that? Or, or what do you put that down to tonight? Yeah, it's hard to sort of uh, have any reasons why we started poorly. You know, for me, it just comes back to individuals whether they, how much importance they place on the footy when they got it in their hands. You know, it's, um, for some reason, we've, uh, it's been a real trend in the back half of the year for us is that we've, you know, we can't hold on to the footy and we invite the opposition down our own end and we just we put pressure on ourselves and it should be the other way around. Um, and you're playing this game, particularly this time of year. Yeah, we're going to be playing for the end of the We're going to be playing up the opposition end tonight. And, you know, you give, a, you give a football side that's probably, you know, it's probably the biggest side across the park in the whole competition, when you give them that much field position and, you know, they get my mentor, it's hard to stop, you know. And it's it's frustrating, it's really frustrating. That's probably the best way to put it, you know. I, when, uh, I can't remember the last time we, we scored first. It wouldn't be many times out of the last dozen matches that we played. You know, to, to get on that trial line after, you know, 10 minutes and talk to the boards, it's just the same old thing and it's really frustrating. So we, you know, we, we need to make a decision as a team where we want to go now for the rest of this season. Uh, it's, it's, it's really in our hands what we want to do with it. You know, we've got, we, we know we're playing next week, so we've got to get our, our recovery right. It was a pretty physical game tonight, but yeah, it's, up, it's really up to us what we do now with, with the rest of the season. We've got three games to go, three possible games, but um, yeah, we've got to turn it around.